Hello, um, today I would like to welcome you to Storytime with Charlotte and Bralin, the great cat spirit. Um, this is what his name is, he better is called Bralin for short. And we are here today to perform for you this story, this very lovely story about a mouse who wishes he could fly. And he is very content on flying to another place in the world. And it's going to be a very lovely story. And Bravin is going to accompany me in this telling this story. But remember that cats meow a lot. But um, Bravin, you're going to be okay, aren't you? You're not going to meow too much, are you, in the story? I guess not. And that is a really good answer, Bravin. I think we can continue now with the story. And now we have what we call the story, which we are going to read. And it's going to be very wonderful. Ah, oh, wonderful. So, let's begin with the beginning of this story. Oh, yes, the beginning. Okay, so let's draw an aeroplane. So, how do we say it? Aeroplane. And we can repeat aeroplane. And one more time, aeroplane, a new word. And we have a mouse here. His name is Twinkle Mouse, and he likes to draw. Yes, he is drawing this aeroplane. And he likes the colors purple. And green. All these green things he likes. And the colour blue too. So we have several things he needs to draw this. And so what is happening over here now with Twinkle Mouse? So what do you see in the attic? that the twinkle can use to build the aeroplane. So now he has moved to design or build the aeroplane. So he has to get the, uh, the things to build the aeroplane. And what will he need? He will need a propeller. This is a propeller. I think so. And we have another thing which he will need to build the aeroplane, which will be the wings, the wings to fly. And what else will Twinkle need for this? And it may be that he needs wheels. Do you see this? The wheels. So wheels. Can you say wheels? Wheels and propeller. Propeller, propeller, and can you say the others thing, which is wings, wings. And these are the things that Twinkle will need, but he will also need colors, green and purple. So purple, and. He is going to fly. Twinkle will fly, I believe. In and he has his friends to help him to fly. So let's look at Twinkle. That's how. That's not how I thought it would look. Mm. Now he's built a plane. I guess 
he didn't think about what it would look like. He just thought that it would look like it did in his imagination, and he seems a bit sad. This is sad. And his friends are trying to help. Oh no! I don't think this plane will get off the ground. And he might be right about that, but I think Twinkle did a very good job in learning to build a plane. I think it's a wonderful invention. So um, a wonderful thing that Twinkle has managed has put together a plane like this. And it doesn't matter what it looks like. I am proud of Twinkle. And what do his friends say? Because Twinkle is still sad over here. Why is he still sad? Come on! Everyone, Twinkle Mills needs our help building an airplane. Okay. I guess the pig wants to really help Twinkle out and it seems like Hair Bear wants to help him out as well and a dog so we have a few friends of Twinkle's that want to make him happy again let's move on so we have a big team of friends of Twinkle. So we have the bear. Um, he has the maps. Oh, he has designs that to how to build instructions on how to build the plane. And Twinkle, who has pieces of wood to help to build the plane. So wood. And we have a bunny. And he has the propeller. And we have the cat who has what does the cat have in? He has a spanner. So we call him spanner. Mm -hmm. Spanner. Mm -hmm. Spanner. Mm -hmm. And we have the dog. What does the dog have in his hand? It is a saw. It's a saw. So we say saw. Saw. And we can go back to see what they are saying. Oh no, actually I forgot this one. The pig. What does the pig have in his hands? It would have to be a drill. So, can you say drill? Drill. Drill. And you got it. And we're going to continue on and see what they have to say. So, I know we can build a plane that will fly. Um, if we all work together to help Twinkle. And that is true. Now we're going to build a plane with Twinkle and his friends. The mouse, the rabbit, the cat, the dog, and the bear. And finally, the pig. And we'll continue on with the story now. And so we have all of his friends together and it looks like they have all built this plane. Let's see what happens. Wow! This new plane looks great! I knew we could do it together! Um, thank you everyone! Thank you! And what happened to Twinkle? Twinkle, Twinkle Mouse is ready.
ready for takeoff. And he is ready for takeoff. As you can see, all his friends have gotten together and helped him to build the plane. And he has lots of love for all of them. And wow, look at this. He's in the air. He is in the sky with lots of blue and lots of clouds and birds. The birds are yellow and green and he is very happy. And well, what happened to Twinkle? It looks like he succeeded. Well, he made the plane and he's taking his all of his friends along. And what is he saying here? He's very excited and he is ready to go on his journey and he will travel somewhere. Yes. I love to travel, and so does Twinkle, and I know that a lot of people do too. So, whee! As you see him travel far, off into the clouds, with his friends, and that is the story from today. And I hoped you enjoyed reading the story, and Bravo was very quiet, he didn't meow. And we are going to close the book.